for the sake of running this experiment, figuring out a higher truth, figuring out an ancillary that can sustain SHBG levels on cycle, I would say that it was worth it. But if I had to spend that money again, I would rather spend it on Anivar because I get better results with Anivar. But let's say I had $5 to spend on either Torchestrone, $5 to spend on Ectisterone, or $5 to spend on Anivar on a daily basis. From an anabolism perspective, five milligrams Anivar wins hands down. I don't care if my HDL goes down. I don't care if my SHBG goes down. The results, the cosmetic appearance, the strength gains, Anivar would win. But if I had $10 to spend every day and I could spend it on Turk, Ecti and VAR, you bet your left testicle I would spend $10 per day to run all three. I'm pretty sure I can spend $300 on that combination every month and make um, very good gains.